So I will save the game and I'll do you guys a little tour of the zoo. So here we are, here's the zoo, here's our entrance. And this is our, this was our first exhibit, which is our timber wolves. Usually when we follow a timber wolf, they, uh, they start pooping. But apparently we've been lucky this time. This is a little, uh, like, over thing. It started raining and they, they all wanted an umbrella. So I just built a really big umbrella. Um, and that's also saved as a blueprint down here. These things. This was our second exhibit. These are the peafowl, uh, who apparently don't have any food. These are our peafowl, um, aka peacock, except they are technically the males. Um, this is their little scratching place here. And then they're like, that's a standard habitat. These are, um, uh, what are they called? <laughs> water pipes, but they, they don't need refilling like the, like the water dishes. And then our third exhibit was these guys, the birds. And this is the first exhibit that I kind of, I went back and worked on the other two, but this is the first exhibit that I like built a little pool in and messed with some terrain stuff. So I kind of learned how to do that in this exhibit um, and then went back and changed the previous exhibits as well. So these were my bears. Yeah, this was the first time that I kind of um, made terrain different, pretty much. My staff area was originally, and these are staff only parts. It was originally here. But then all the guests complained that they didn't want to see the building, so we moved it back. Um, and then my next exhibit was these guys, the tigers. And I'm particularly proud of this waterfall. There we go. We can go and have a look at our tigers who I think are sleeping. Oh, here we go. Is this tomorrow? This is tomorrow's friend. And here are our Bengal tigers. Oh, was it was it after the Bengal tigers that we did the tortoise? I can't remember the the order, um, but these are the tortoise. So they have a walkthrough exhibit like the like the peacocks, like the peafowl. Um, and these guys have been really cool because uh, they've had a lot of baby tortoise and they live for a really long time as well, which is really cool. Look at him plodding along. And then I built this bit over here which is um, a little kind of, I've called it reptiles, but then they're, they're not all reptiles. We have some beetles, spiders, scorpions. And then here we have our froggies. And then this is me fighting a fear because I'm very scared of snakes. I know it's a game. I know it's a game, but two snakes. Uh, oh my God, see, it just freaks me out. But we have two snakes in there as well. Um, and then I built this, which is our savannah enclosure. And this is the first time that I built this kind of walkway over the enclosure. And these are some animals that are different but can be housed together. We have some warthogs, we have ostrich, uh, we also have somewhere a zebra too. Um, and these guys are all happily living together, which you can figure out from here. If I have a look, click on this and then you click on interspecies enrichment. Um, and they actually be enriched by sharing their stuff. So that's pretty much the zoo. I really love making waterfalls. I've really enjoyed doing that too. Um, it's relatively small in comparison to a lot of other people's zoos, but we've stayed in money. We've stayed making profit the whole time, which is great. And I'm desperately, desperately trying to get our happiness rating up. Um, but it's taking quite a lot. Hunger and thirst really are the main thing right now. Thank you so much for being here. If you'd like to come back, you can hit that follow button and maybe come back and see us sometime. That'd be pretty cool. You look like you could use some coffee. I'll see you soon. Bye.